So today I decided to show you my closet. You might have seen it in pictures on my blog in the background, but today I'm gonna show you what's in my closet. So follow me! the closet looks like it was actually a bedroom but since we have three bedrooms we decided to turn one into a walk-in closet this has been a dream for a long long time for me because when I was living in Paris my apartment was tiny 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 and I couldn't like fit my clothes anywhere properly so I'm so happy that we have this room it's the first room that we finished in our apartment which tells you a lot about us but anyway, here it is. Um, everything you see is from IKEA, which is the cheaper alternative to do a closet that looks great and that fits what you need. So um, yeah, I'm gonna show you what I have. So I'm really organized when it comes to my clothes. So I have everything organized by cut or by colors. So over here I have all my tank tops, I have t-shirts, I have kind of oversized cardigans and blouses. And down here I have everything with long sleeves. So as you know, if you read my blog, my style changes from day to day. So I have some really colorful pieces like this top, which is from Primark. It was super cheap, something like four euros, but I think it looks great. I have tons of t-shirts. I actually love Marvin t-shirts. I think they do amazing t-shirts and I absolutely love them. Um, I have all kinds of things. I have really colorful pieces. I have some great things that I found in vintage stores like this one which is something that I found in Copenhagen and I think it's great because it's vintage and it looks absolutely great and was super cheap as well. So yeah, I have a lot of things and as you can see I have a lot of pieces with long sleeves because in Belgium the weather is absolutely awful so you always need to wear a knit or to wear a cardigan even in summer. And right now one of my favorite thing is this jumper from H&M. I think it looks great because it's pastel, it has this shiny material and yeah, I just absolutely love it. I have, yeah, again, a lot of colors. I have things with sequins, I have things with um, chain details. So since this closet is pretty big, I'm really lucky because I can hang everything because I hate folding my closets because Every time you try to grab something, everything falls down the floor and it drives me crazy. So I'm really happy to have everything hang. So over here I have my maxi skirts. This one is from Topshop. This one is also it's from Copenhagen as well and I think it looks amazing. I have all kinds of pants that I can't really roll because I roll my jeans. I'm going to show you that later. All kinds of pants basically. Then moving on to skirts, I have all my mini skirts, I have shorts, I don't really wear shorts but I have quite a bit of them. And then I have all my skirts, as you can see also I really like to wear colorful skirts. So then underneath it I keep all my bags, again it's organized by colors, so I have black, I have blue, brown, grey, vintage, I have lots of vintage bags. I have a ton of them. Then I have two drawers. In the first one, I keep everything related to the gym. It's not really interesting. And the second one keeps all my scarves. Again, organized by color because I'm kind of a control freak when it comes to my clothes. So yeah, that's it. I love wearing scarves. So when I was planning this room, I wanted to make sure that everything has a place. I wear a lot of dresses, so it was really important to me to have all of them in one spot. So I have all my everyday dresses in here and I have my maxi dresses in here. I told you, I love to wear dresses. Then I have all my maxi dresses. I love maxi dresses. I think they look awesome on everyone. And one of my all-time favorite is this one because it's from Lova and it's absolutely gorgeous. The silk is just insane. I love the color and I got that one during the private sales in Paris and I was so happy to have a Lova dress because it's like a dream come true. So 
this is probably one of my favorite pieces in my whole closet so then over here I have more bags and I have this pair of shoes that you've already seen on the blog as well I absolutely love them I got them at Versace outlet in Paris and these are probably the most incredible shoes I own and actually they're pretty easy to walk in they don't look like it but they are and yeah I just absolutely love them I think it's me in a shoe <laughs> I have two more drawers so one of my biggest tips to organize your closet is that when I was organizing my jeans I didn't really know how to do it but then I decided to roll them basically because you don't really need to iron them so you can roll them up and I've organized them by color by wash I have some black ones so you see and you you really save a lot of space and I mean you can like easily find one you're looking for. Basically it's the easiest way I found to store your jeans. Then in the second drawer I have some leggings, some random accessories like um, this and then some random summer shoes. So moving on to blazers and jacket. I have a lot of them. Um, so yeah I have this blazer from Topshop which, look, which looks great because it has silk, it has jersey, so it's really really nice. This one is probably my favorite one. I got it at H&M two years ago. It was ago. part of the garden collection and every time I wore it, everybody's like, oh my god, where is your jacket from? And it was from H&M again. Now we're moving on to shoes. <laughs> so, shoes. What to say, I love shoes. It's like my favorite accessory, so it was an evidence to me to have a lot of shoe shelves. So I have I big ones for high heels and then I have smaller ones for my flats because I love to wear flats and I have fun of them. So, um, shoes. One of my all-time favorite pairs, this one, which I got on sale. These are Christian Louboutin. They are stunning. I love them. I have this one, which are from Prada, I absolutely love Prada shoes, they're comfortable and they always look great. And when I went to Hong Kong, I was 17 years old, maybe 18 years old at the time, I saw this one, but they were so expensive that I couldn't really buy them. But the next summer, I was in the south of France and I was browsing a second hand shop and I found them! And it was the perfect size, the perfect price as well. So I'm so happy and ever since I got them, I wear them all the time. Isabelle Marron sneakers that I got a month ago after chasing them. You saw the article on my, on my blog. Um, so yeah, ever since I got them, I wear them pretty much all the time. So, more Prada shoes, I mean. What can you say about these? These are absolutely beautiful. Prada, again. More Prada, again. Let's guess. Prada, yeah. So, flats. Lot of flats. Lot of every single color of flats you can think of. As you can see, I have quite of an obsession with the Marc Jacobs Mouse flats. I think I have seven pairs of them. Um, this is kind of my favorite flats to wear. I mean, how can you say no to the art face? So one of my tips to organize your shoes is to only pop one in the front because, I mean, your shoes are the same from the left to the right. So you don't really need to see both of them and you gain so much space by doing that. So I put the right feet in front of the left one so I know that the one I pick up is always the right one. But, I mean, it saves me so much space and I do the same thing with flats because I know my shoes, I know what I want to wear. So I don't need to see both of them. So one of my tips to organize your clutches is to use um, book holders. I got these at Ikea and they fit perfectly. And that way, when you take one clutch, you don't have everything falling over. Um, so it's really practical and you can like separate them by colors. So this is the last part of accessory heaven. I have more clutches and small bags. I have random makeup bags. Then 
this is serious business. I have a ton of statement rings. I love to wear big chunky uh, cocktail rings. So I have all kinds, I have all colors. This one has a solid perfume in it. Um, so yeah, I have really, really big one and I have tiny little ones as well. The next thing all all my bracelets. I have cuffs, I have spikes, as you can see. I have colorful little bracelets to put on during summer. I think they look absolutely amazing. Then I have necklaces. I have, again, a ton of them. Basically. And then the next drawer has all my hearing. And then last but not least, I have my watches. I love to wear watches. Then, moving on to the four last drawers. The first one has all my sunglasses. I love to wear sunglasses. And the last two have belts in them. I have all kinds of belts. These are the tiny skinny belts that I have. Well, they're not the tiny, but these ones are huge. I have really big belts. If you see what I mean. All kinds of colors. I'm really an accessory girl. I think they, I think a great accessory can really change your whole outfit. So this is my nail polish collection that you saw in a previous video. I build the rack myself, which I'm pretty proud of, and it holds all my nail polishes, which is so cool. So that's it from my closet. I hope you enjoyed the tour. I hope you got some great tips and I will see you very soon.